Changing money can be done at a cash exchange or a bank, and the uninitiated are usually surprised to see at least two rates for each currency pair. The first two rates are prices which a broker buys or sells currencies. The middle rate is usually the central bank's exchange rate that's only available to commercial banks. The money changes profit is assured by the sell price always being higher than the buy price. In short, the money changer will pay you less for a currency, but then sell it for more. In forex trading, the two rates are referred to as bid and ask rates. The bid is the rate which the broker buys a currency pair, and the ask is the rate which the broker sells the pair. When you are considering opening a trading position, one of the first things you will notice in the execution window is that it displays both the bid and ask rates. The difference between the two rates is referred to as the spread. For a call, a buying position, you will be opening at the higher bid rate, while for a put, a selling position, you will be opening at the lower ask rate. Importantly, it is the market price that determines your entry and exit rates. It is important to know the market price is nearly always moving, and in order for you to eventually profit, your asset value must cover the distance between the market price and the spread you have paid. Then, when the position is closed, it occurs via the ask and bid rates again, and the value of each pip compared to your entry level is calculated with your exit price, which creates your profit or loss for the trade. Once again, the spread is the broker's profit margin or service fee. In straight-through processing, this serves as the broker's risk margin when brokering a transaction between a buyer and a seller. And today, because most transactions are executed via digital platforms, spreads have declined in price because brokers are battling each other for clients. Some spreads are as little as a fraction of a pip. The competition between brokers allows traders to literally shop around for good prices. You will see some assets with better spreads and others with more expensive costs. And this is a reason some traders open accounts with several brokers, taking advantage of their competitive spreads.